DJ Ayrton. I was born in 1992. All right, I started skating about seven years ago. My friend Edgar was on my baseball team. He really inspired me to get into it, and he showed me through his creativity, you know, how cool it could be. It's kind of what inspired me to get into it. When I was coming up, Edgar Tichenol was my best friend. This kid could kill it. I don't know, just watching him ride, everything seems so effortless. Um, if we want to talk pro skaters, uh, Tori Pudwell really inspires me. Uh, he's got such amazing speed and agility, you know. Everything just seems so on point and aggressive and clean. I just, I can't get over the way he skates. That makes me want to skate like that. I like skateboarding because it's so, you know, there's no rules, no schedule, you know. I can get up any time of day, day or night, freezing cold out, it doesn't matter, I can go skateboard. There's no baseball practice, you know, there's no hours involved. Skateboarding is just, it's on my terms, it's on my rules, you know. When I'm out on my board, I just, uh, I don't know, man, I'm free to do whatever I want, say whatever I want, you know, I can laugh, scream, cry, it doesn't matter. No one's gonna judge me for it. I'm out there doing what I gotta do every day, you know? And it's, it's something that I can always come back to, you know, my skateboard's always gonna be there in the morning. Ain't gotta worry about it breaking my heart and whatnot. I like being on the team because it's like, you know, everybody's my friend, everybody's up, out there to hype you up, you know, you're out there to hype them up. It just, you know, when you see another person do a trick, it almost inspires you to, oh, I can do that trick, I can do, I can do something better than tr that trick. In fact, hey, yo, watch this. Like, when, I, when I'm out there with Harrison and the boys and the girls, you know, Colette and, you know, Colette's my girl, dude. I just, I don't know, man. These people just make me want to ride so much more. Like, in the last six months of being on the team, the progression has just been incredible. You know, everything just feels totally different. It's like a family to me. I came home from the skate barn one evening, and I went out on my basketball court in my backyard in the dark. You know, I just had one overhead light, and... I just remember sitting there dripping sweat, trying to do these kick flips just over and over again, just bashing my shins and ankles, and I wouldn't stop for whatever reason. Something pushed me to do it, and then I landed it. And for me, that was that was pretty much the moment I knew I was a skateboarder. Five years from now, I see myself, you know, skating every day, having fun, you know, doing my thing and living my life. But. I also want to go back to school. I'm going to Green River right now. I'm going to come out in two years with an AA, so hopefully five years from now you'll see DJ Ertin with a bachelor's degree. Yeah, um, I'm actually going to get into architecture pretty soon and follow an engineering pathway, but skateboarding's always going to be there for me, you know, it's, it's my life. <laughs>